Hey, it's 2021 and most of us are working from home now than we've ever done before. It also means that most of us are having meetings and taking calls online like than never before. Now, whether you use a brand new laptop or an older model, there is something that plagues us all. And that's the fact that the inbuilt webcam that come with these devices do a really crappy job at capturing video and producing a decent video output. Now, I personally believe it is equally as important to have a very good feed for your video calls like you would personally prepare for a professional meeting. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you some tips and tricks and teaching you how you can level up your video calls by using your smartphone as a webcam so that you get that crisp and clear professional video feed and level up the calls for every meeting you take going forward. Hi, my name is Peter and on this channel I try to share tech tips and tricks and really cool ways you could use tech uh, to, to, to enhance your life. Uh, so, like I said earlier, I'm going to be teaching you how to use your smartphone as a webcam on your computer for video calls. Now, there are going to be two ways I'll be showing you quickly. Uh, the first is a paid method or a paid app and the second is a free app. Now, let's talk about the gear for a second. Uh, we're going to need four things to be able to do this. Um, the, one of them will be optional only for the free. Uh, so the first thing we will need is your smartphone. Uh, the second thing we need is your laptop. The third thing you're going to need is a USB cable uh, for your phone. And then the final thing, this is for the free version, by the way. And then finally, you're going to need some sort of tripod stand or mount or a desk mount for your phone. So I'm going to start with the paid pro version. Um, the paper route version is actually an app uh, by this company known as New Tech uh, called the NDI HX Camera. You can simply go to your app store or play store and look for it. Now it is paid and it actually will cost you about $20, it's about 10,000 Nigerian Naira um, to get this app. And it does come with a few pro features, uh, which includes the ability to actually wirelessly over the same Wi-Fi network as your laptop transmit um, you know your video uh, so once you go ahead and install this app open it and then you would see that it has a few settings uh, that can that you can play around with but I'm not going to talk about this right now now the next thing you need to do is actually download a companion app for your laptop so head on to the ndi.tv website the, the links are going to be in the description uh, and then there's an NDI tools section. Uh, now, the thing about NDI tools is it's a bundle of different software because NDI is such a professional tool and has so many things. But what we are interested in the most is the webcam input. Uh, so go ahead and download the NDI tools. You're going to have to fill a form, put in your email address and a few things, and then you'll get mailed a link. And then once you download it, um, it will tell you thank you for choosing NDI 5. Now, once you've downloaded it, go ahead and start it up and then um, install the NDI tools, install it on your computer, um, and then just agree to the licenses. Yeah, and then we're installing it, so just wait for it to configure, it's going to validate your packages. Um, and then this is basically installing a driver onto your computer that enables uh, what you have on your um, NDI app on your mobile to transmit onto uh, your computer. So that's it. Installation is done. So now what I'm going to do is go run NDI virtual input and then select Peter's iPhone, which is my iPhone as a source for NDI. And then I'm going to test this now on a uh, video conferencing tool. For me, I'm going to pick Zoom because it's one of the most popular and favorite ones, but this can work on any video conferencing app. Okay. Um, so I'm going to run a new meeting and I'm doing this real life. So this is my um, FaceTime webcam. As you can see, uh, the feed is horrible. So let's go ahead and pick something else. So I'm going to pick video and then select the camera and I'll pick the NDI video. And oh, yes, so time to change direction. Okay. And you can see already how good this looks. Like this is already looking way better than what I had. This is what I had with the FaceTime webcam. And you can see the quality. And this is what I currently have, the NDI video, which is a whole different ball game. And then this is clean and sharp and crisp. And it's using the power of my camera. And on the NDI tools, you're able to actually change 
uh, the resolution and make it even better. Um, so next I'm going to talk about the free option and let's see how that works as well. And now I'm going to show you the free app uh, to be able to do this as well. Um, the free app is called the Orion um, webcam app. Uh, you can quickly search it. Orion is titled um, or spelled I-R-I-U-N. I just go to the App Store or the Play Store and download it. And then once you have it downloaded, open it up. Uh, there's a little uh, sort of tutorial on the screen. You just swipe by and say, let's go. Now, um, it's going to tell you that it's waiting for the connection and it has the ability to connect via Wi-Fi and via cable. But we're going to use cable because I feel um, it's you may not always have Wi-Fi. And considering that this is free, it's not a bad thing to just plug in your cable to your computer and you're good to go. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do is get my cable, plug it into my phone. Uh, but before I, 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 I plug it into the computer, I'm going to go ahead and download the Orion app for uh, the computer. So you go to the Orion website, which is iriun.com. And then there's the webcam for Windows, Mac and Ubuntu, and you can choose whichever one you want. Uh, once you have it installed and downloaded. So first of all, I'm going to plug in my phone in, plug in the cable and then plug it into my phone. And with that, I'm going to go to the desktop and start the app. So start the Orion webcam app and then um, it's going to connect. And you can see it connected right now and I can have a little I have a little preview screen where I can actually see the feed or uh, it looks really good I'm gonna go ahead and uh, test this on zoom as well so start the zoom up I'm gonna start a new call just start a new meeting um, as you can see this is my FaceTime uh, looking very FaceTimey uh, <laughs> it's my FaceTime HD camera and I'm going to switch it over to the Orion webcam um, and woo, there you have it, you know, we'll just adjust this for a second, there you go and boom, your meeting's a bit, a hundred times better. Um, I do love the free the, this because it still gives you quite some um, amount of detail. There's still a pro version for this, by the way, but um, I believe this is it's still able to give you a decent amount of quality details to level up uh, your video calls and make your calls even better. Yeah, so that was it. Um, I hope you're able to learn from this, level up your video calls and take it up to the next level. And please let me know if you have any questions or comments please drop them down every link will be in the description box below um, please put any comments you have or any questions and i'll be happy to answer them and hey by the way this is a very fresh youtube channel we're still exploring a new top a lot of new topics if you want me to be able to show or teach or, or, or give a tech tip on anything you want also put that in the comment box i will be sure to read your comments and respond accordingly uh till next time uh, this is Peter. Cheers.